In a compelling address before the International Court of Justice, Riyadh Mansour, the permanent observer of Palestine to the United Nations, underscored the urgent need for justice and peace in the region. He emphasized that the future of freedom, justice and peace could commence immediately. Mansour appealed to the court to recognize the illegality of the occupation and urged for decisive action to bring it to an end. He implored the international community to uphold international law and ensure justice for all parties involved. Mansour envisioned a future where Palestinian children are treated with dignity, where human rights are universal and where violence is eradicated. Central to his message was the aspiration for a future where Palestinians and Israelis coexist peacefully in two separate states. In a recent report, global rating agency Fitch highlighted concerns regarding Pakistan's political uncertainty following a closely contested election. Fitch emphasized the importance of securing a financing agreement with the IMF to stabilize Pakistan's credit profile. However, the agency expressed apprehension, suggesting that prolonged negotiations or failure to secure the agreement could heighten external liquidity stress and increase the risk of default. Fitch noted that Pakistan has only fulfilled a portion of its $18 billion funding plan for the fiscal year ending June 2024, excluding routine debt rollovers. This shortfall raises concerns considering the projected external funding needs. Despite these challenges, Fitch expects efforts to secure an IMF agreement in the coming months. However, the uncertain political landscape and potential delays in negotiations pose significant risks to Pakistan's economic stability and creditworthiness, warranting close attention and proactive measures to address looming financial pressures. In a recent interview with Geo News, PTI Senator Faisal Javed expressed confidence in party chief Imran Khan's electoral prospects, affirming Khan's intention to contest elections from Miawali with the belief that he will once again assume the role of Pakistan's Prime Minister. Javed highlighted the significant voter turnout on February 8, deeming it unprecedented in the nation's history. However, it's worth noting that following the events of May 9 and the subsequent state crackdown on the PTI, Javed had gone into hiding. His reappearance coincided with a hearing at the Peshawar High Court. <laughs> लगता है बड़े मुश्किल हालत आप पे गुजरे बाल लंबे किए दाढ़ी रख ली है सब पे ही गुजरे लेकिन अब अल्लाह से दुआ है कि अल्लाह पाकिस्तान पाकिस्तान जितने मजलूम लोग हैं सब के लिए दुआ है कि जल्द वो अपनों के साथ हो और सबसे ज्यादा इंतजार है इमरान खान का पाकिस्तान की आन पाकिस्तान की शान इमरान खान in a significant announcement, PTI leader Barrister Gohar Ali Khan revealed that party-backed independent candidates who secured victories in the 2024 general elections would align with the right-wing Sunni Ittihad Council as part of their parliamentary strategy. This decision, endorsed by party leaders and SIC officials, aims to strengthen PTI's presence in the National Assembly and across provinces. Gore emphasized a formal agreement with SIC to be submitted to the Election Commission of Pakistan, safeguarding reserved seats and party members' interests. We had a meeting meeting yesterday. We went to the side of Allah and the government of Nasir. And we had a meeting meeting there. سب کی کنسنسس سے اور سب کے مشورے سے کیونکہ یہ ہمارا اتحاد اس ملک کے لیے ہے اور ہمارا جو پہلے ایک دوسرے کے ساتھ کنسنسس تھا وہ اس ملک کے لیے تھا اس کی ڈیموکریسی کے لیے تھا اور ہم نے اس سخت حالات میں ایک دوسرے کو کھندا دینا تھا تاکہ ہم آئین اور قانون کے مطابق آگے بڑھیں اب جب کہ آزاد کینڈیڈیٹ ہے ہمارے वो चाहे प्रोविंशियल इसम्बली में है पंजाब के चाहे वो प्रोविंशियल इसम्बली के पी के में है चाहे वो नेशनल इसम्बली में है अब कंसेंसस के साथ हमारा ये फैसला हो चुका है कि हमारे कैंडिडेट्स वो नेशनल इसम्बली में और वो प्रोविंशियल इसम्बली पंजाब और प्रोविंशियल इसम्बली के पी के इन शाह 
सुनी इतिहाद काउंसिल को एज अ पार्टी ज्वाइन करेंगे एस आई सी इज हाफ इज रेजरेट दलायंस लॉन्ग स्टैंडिंग हिस्ट्री एंड क्लैरिफाई द डिसीजन कंसेंस विद पी टी आई लीडरशिप एम्फोसाइजिंग ऑपोजिशन टू सेक्टेरियन वायलेंस एंड मिलिटेंसी रेजर फर्म अनकंडीशनल सपोर्ट टू पी टी आई पॉलिसी अंडरलाइनिंग इमरान खान अथॉरिटी